I had um, an idea about what Tuscany would be like, but physically being in all these little villages on the hilltops with the flags and the cobblestones, and it's just like a fairy tale. You know, when I thought of coming to Italy, I thought of the places that everybody has heard of and known, and to be able to go to places that I'd never heard of uh, it was just like finding an, uh, a treasure or something. The fact that Drake's been here so many times, he has these little gems that he finds. And the intimacy of him knowing the language so well and knowing the culture so well and these locations so well, it's just always so warm and inviting and comfortable and not to mention yummy and delicious. The meal that we had never would have happened mm -hmm. if we weren't with Drake because it was a place that he knew and you could only get there by walking up and it was like you're sitting on top of this cliff, mm -hmm. you're looking down, these lemon orchards are all on the, the mountain, the coast is down there, you're eating all this food that's like lemon infused, you can smell the lemon, and it was like perfect weather, the sun's going down, it was like, man, I could die right now. Just besides seeing little quaint places that only really locals know about, meeting locals and we were looking around and taking pictures of this cute little village and a little lady came up in, in thick Italian and explaining that that was her home and that we could go up the stairs and look and, and just trying to communicate with somebody who speaks another language and, and having that real personal connection with another person from another culture, from another country. You just don't experience those types of things. And then to be able to walk up and see the little charm of centuries old buildings it was pretty cool. You know, that's the best part about the trip is uh, getting away from the tourist traps and seeing things that others don't see. The cities we were in had buildings that were a thousand years old and to go in those and, and take photographs of them is just something that most people don't get to do. They get to see the same thing that a thousand other people have seen that same day and it's always crowded and we've been in places where we're by ourselves.